The Pentagon is asking Congress to spend more than a billion dollars immediately to buy hundreds of blast-resistant vehicles known as MRAPs. U.S. troops can't wait for them much longer. Jamie McIntyre explains what's taken so long to get that life-saving equipment to the front lines. This video from a test last year at the Army's Aberdeen Proving Ground shows just how mine-resistant these mine-resistant vehicles are. The unique V-shaped underbelly deflects the force of the blast, leaving the test dummies inside unscathed. But while the virtues of the mine-resistant ambush-protected vehicles, or MRAPs, have been known for years, commanders overseeing the current surge in Iraq are still waiting for them to show up. We have none now. What I'm working with are the up-armored Humvees. The Humvees are death traps compared to the MRAPs, but so far only the Marines, based in western Iraq, have significant numbers of the bomb-resistant vehicles, because they ordered them well before the Army. The tragedy, the tragedy, is the number of wounded and the number who died who could have lived. And They say about 70 percent of the soldiers that died in Iraq had to do with IEDs and Humvees. That's hard to live with. One problem, a single company, Force Protection Inc., was awarded a series of non-competitive contracts and then fell behind schedule. A Pentagon Inspector General's report, triggered by Congresswoman Slaughter's complaint, found another contractor could have potentially met the contract requirements in much less time. The company says it did its best to meet an overly ambitious schedule and paid penalties for late deliveries. And it insists its line of MRAPs, including one model called the Cougar, is delivering on the key promise to save lives. But what I tell uh, people in the Pentagon is uh, since you increased Servicemen's Group life insurance to $250,000 per soldier or Marine, uh, you count up my eight seats in the vehicle, uh, the taxpayer is getting a great bargain because everybody's coming home alive in Cougars.